Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So after posting earlier today that Google had announced that search now lets you hide sponsored search results, the video will be linked. Google has announced some more changes that it's bringing to its different products and services. Now, Google says that back in August, as I have posted, and as you may well know, it introduced its largest image editing model, which is called Nano Banana. Create an image, or if you click on Tools, there we go. I don't know if you can see that in the video, but that's got a little banana icon next to Create Images, which comes from Gemini 2.5 Flash, which is now the latest model. And since the introduction of Nano Banana back in August, Google says that more than 5 billion images have been generated using the tool to date. Now, because of this, Google says it's now bringing Nano Banana to Google Search. So more improvements and updates are rolling out for Google Search. Over and above what I posted on earlier, as mentioned. And Notebook LM and soon to photos, although no specifics are given regarding photos. Now a little bit more regarding the Google search integration. Just using a GIF provided from and a video clip provided from the announcement. Google says that the Google search integration comes as part of Google Lens, which is used to search for images and pictures from your phone. So users on both Android and iOS will find a new create mode in the lens interface and then by either taking a new photo or selecting an existing one from their gallery you'll be able to use Nano Banana to instantly modify and transform your images and Google says that not only you can search with an image but you can also use the image as a canvas for AI powered editing directly within the Google app. So that's in the Google app on Android and iOS devices currently. Now for me, I don't know if this is actually that necessary. And I'm asking the question here, why did Google integrate AI image editing into Google search? Because it doesn't seem that necessary. Because Google Lens is used for searching. And if you want to edit an image, you can go to other apps, not Google search. Unless obviously Google is just making it a one-stop shop, so to speak. But asking the question why do they integrate AI image editing into Google search let me know your thoughts down below if you've got another opinion or another view now over and above Nano Banana being integrated now into Google search as mentioned it's also available in Notebook LM which is Google's AI powered writing and research assistant which I have posted on previously on the channel where Google says that as part of Notebook LM, Nano Banana is now working under the hood, as it's saying, to make video overviews, which helps you generate and explain a video presented to you by AI if you are using Notebook LM. I have posted on this previously um, video overviews and audio overviews. So it's making those video overviews more helpful according to Google. And it brings six new styles to overviews like watercolor and a name and can generate contextual illustrations based on your sources and powers a new format called Brief, according to Google, for when you only need quick insights. Now, now I haven't seen any of these new features we're talking about today because they are both on a controlled rollout. And Google says that in the weeks ahead, it's also going to bring Nano Banana to Google Photos, but at this stage, no time or specifics have been given. And obviously, as always, if I get knowledge of that, I'll try and keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.